Yo, what's up, my peoples? Today we're playing Beyond Good and Evil 20th Anniversary Edition, courtesy of the Ubisoft Creators Program, which I'm a proud member of. This is an unscripted review, which means I review the game while playing the game. Uh, no notes, I just go off the dome. I may stumble my words, whatever, whatever. It is what it is. Uh, bad things may happen. No edits usually, though sometimes I do edit if it's too long or too many fails, but usually right off the dome. So the game is available, it's been available since uh, June 25th. I'm late playing, so I do want to apologize to uh, Ubisoft for that. They had gave me the code, and I'm late playing. So here we are, we're going to check out the trailer, and then we're going to talk a little bit more about the game. Let's do this. Yeah! Jade, 20 years ago, your parents put you under my care. We came to Hillis. Back then, it was a peaceful planet. I had hoped to raise you there safely. The war has arrived at the gates of Hillis. They're coming. This peaceful mining planet in System 4 is now completely encircled by the Dark Armada. General Can't go there, Jade. If you want, I'll go alone. Okay, we'll go together. But I'm sticking to you like bees on honey, whether you like it or not. Wow! A rock of D-53. I'll come back for you. Paige, you've been hiding this from me for the past 20 years. Doesn't that look so beautiful? All right, so real talk. I never played Beyond Good and Evil. You know, with them thinking about coming out with a sequel, uh, and they're making this game available once again now in 4K, playing on the Xbox Series X today. And um, I think it's going to be very cool. Um, very cool. So, let's go ahead and hop into it. Look at it. Most people are rating this game five stars. Five stars. Like, it's perfect. Um, Some say, there's no such thing as a perfect game. I'm going to tell you why people do that. Because it's near perfect. Okay? Near perfect. Very close to perfectiono. And then... They just put in some, you know, some, I do have a controller. All right, here. They're putting some respect on. I was going to play this yesterday. Then Xbox had some issues and, but he, we, we're here today. So, here today. So I'm going to be playing about 20 to 30 minutes of this game. If you want to see more, I may go over to 20, 30 minutes mark. But probably not. <laughs> it just depends. I'm real busy right now. And I'm trying to get a lot in on today. But for future content, for more Beyond Good and Evil, make sure you check out the ADG vs. Game channel, which is my walkthrough channel. And most of all, my Twitch channel, where I'll be on there daily playing tons of games. Various games. Support me on my Twitch channel. Links will be in the description. All the video for the Twitch channel and the ADG vs. Game channel. All right, let's get it. So this game is also connected to Ubisoft Connect. They got a gallery in here. Anniversary gallery. They got a speed run mode for those that like to do all that. Uh, they got some bonuses in here. I think that is the anniversary gallery. <laughs>
Everything's from the conception phase, the pre-production phase, the public reveal, the launch, Jaden and Paige through the ages, secret stuff, bonus videos, what? 2003 bonus video and a 2023 bonus video. Lost levels. What kinds of cool little stuff in here? Some of the visuals from the launch here. Sometimes content creators like myself take stuff like this and they reuse it. Maybe certain images, blow them up and reuse them for their own, you know, little special thumbnails and whatnot. So, I love gaps. I love gaps. Let's go back. Right, let's check out the options. I'm just gonna go to the settings here, not how to play. I'm gonna set mine on uh, resolution and not performance. I'm gonna do vibration light. Cause I'll be conserving batteries and vibration is cool, but it don't have to be everything. It don't have to be on superb. Cut scene volume, music volume. I think we should be fine, but I'm going to turn the music down just a little bit. Just a little bit. You know we got to show them subtitles in our YouTube videos. Ain't going to touch nothing else. See what these changes, and let's go ahead and begin the game. It is. The war has arrived at the gates of Hillis. This peaceful mining planet in System 4 is now completely encircled by the Dom's Armada. General Keck, Supreme Commander of the Alpha Forces, would like to take this opportunity to address a final message to the population. Loyal Hillians. The impending battle will be a difficult one, but thanks to the Alpha Section, Okay, this thing already didn't get started. Bang, I had to pause uh, and cut the mic on. All right, here we go. Next to fight. These kids have got to duck. 
by aliens and seem like Get them combos. You be saw them trying to do their thing in presentation. Way back in the day with this one. in slow motion for some reason. I guess they're trying to make sure it's epic. First fight. Let's go. And release it. Let's go. In the eye, Jade! That's his Achilles heel! How you know so much about his thing? Ooh la la! Let's test the blue tra la la. We're gonna be able to pay to get the hovercraft fixed with that. <laughs> hey, Secundo, scan this for me, will ya? Okay, Yeet. Per Daramis. Bueno, Yid, but be careful. I did a checkup on you after your fight, and I noticed something got inside your psycho karma. Hmm. So it's just, I guess, a collection of pearls and things, and it's the first one that we found. Sections. Patrol 21, all's clear. You may go up without fear. It'd be a cool thing. Thanks for your help. It's the Alpha Section's duty to protect all the citizens of Millie's booties. <laughs> Ah. Here on Hillis, war has once again reared its ugly head, striking the civilian population. Luckily, our elite forces have once again arrived in the nick of time. I'm coming to you live from the Southern Lighthouse Shelter. Here is where some of the children whose parents have been captured by the Doms have been taken in by two devoted and courageous Hillians. Miss, a word for our listeners. Uh, yeah, okay. yeah. Well, you guys are not what I'd call as fast as a speeding bullet. Keep doing nothing. 
And next time, there'll be nothing left here to save. Cut. Hey, Pop, stay zen. Don't get your snout bent out of shape. All right, boys, that's a wrap. Pack it up. Thanks, Paige. If it wasn't for you, I... I... on the Blitz, we're sitting ducks for every Vorax in the area. What a pessimisto. You faithful servant, Secundo, has found the answer to your money problemo. Secundo, we're stuck here. No hovercraft, no shield. Optima has cut off the power. The account is empty. Units, you want units, you come to Secundo, mia bella. Listen to this. The director, Senora from the Science Center, wants a collection of all the animals on the planet. She pay you dinero for any photo you send with little animal on it. Mira, that beast, for example. You take picture of it and tenga mucho units. Even your perro interest them. Not another one of your hair-brained plans, Segundo. Gonna have to recheck your circuits. Who could possibly be interested in that kind of thing? We're in the middle of a war, son. You understand nada, bacon breath. Control of the species is mucho importante. Yet, you go get your camera back, and we'll see if Secundo has pepperoni on his processor. Ciao! I found your camera, Jade. I put it right over there. Hi, Jade. I see Secundo already talked to you about the job. The war is taking its toll. We need a complete inventory of all species living on the planet. Thanks for the picture. Good luck. All right, so we see any species, take a picture. Makes sense. It's all good. We already got one of those, I'm not sure. Oh, already taken. Good thing we got the alpha sections to protect us. Be brave. We gotta stay strong. Gotta be strong, bud. That big thing. You can tell I never played because I'm, I'm just like, you know, all over Since the place. Those doms that took away our parents, huh, Jay? Yeah, but they may still be alive. Maybe I wasn't supposed to go over here. Those stupid doms are gonna get us all. We're all gonna die. Don't worry. You're all safe here in the lighthouse.
careful, Jane. They seem to be keeping their distance for the time being. But we gotta hurry up and get that shield reactivated. A field armadillo. They're becoming very rare. Vorax. We're seeing more and more of them these days. Yeah, you see I'm just collecting these right now. Okay, Yid. I transferred the dinero to the stinking Optima service. Electricity restored. Thank you for choosing Optima service. Okay, we're gonna get to this mission, see what this is about. Jade reporting. Jade reporting. Mission M disk standing. This is pretty cool. That you, Jade? We just got one of them M disks. Might be another job for Jade Reporting and Company. If you can read it now, and give me a chance to adjust this stupid decoder player that refuses to obey its master. Gotcha. Okay, we got a conversational piece here. Does the plan work? Good thing the alpha section showed up. how we say um i do want to go a little bit longer if possible sibyl it's been digitalized Tell me to push that then. As you see I'm stuck, so I may end. Um I do want to say a few things. I can already tell this game was like like I, I said in, in early in the video, I can tell it was ahead of its time. Uh there's so many things that we see still like implemented in uh games today as far as level design and more. I do think that the story is oh, going to yeah, be epic. Right. Batteries are shot. Batteries are shot. It's very open world. I think that's another thing that people enjoyed at the time. insane 
I know I only scratched the surface, but there's plenty of reviews out there. I don't think this game really like needs a review. But I will say it looks feel disabled. Do I want to disable it? Do I want I think it, the only thing is for some people, even myself, I'm used to a game kind of telling me what to do. And right now I don't know what to do. Um, outside of that, I'm sure it's going to be a great adventure, uh, a great story. And like I said, a, a game that just was ahead of the time probably. So with that being said, I'm going to end this video. Remember going forward, if you want to see more of this game, you need to check me out on the AG vs. Game channel. And on the Twitch channel, I'll be live streaming this game sometimes. I'll just be doing videos like I did today, this video sometime. Yeah. Um, presentation seems amazing in this game for its time, though. I just want to keep saying that because it needs to be known. Very great presentation. So, I'm gonna see if I can find me a guy. If I can learn a little bit more for the next time I play. Once again, links will be in the description of the video for the AG vs. Game and the Twitch channel. This has been the 21st anniversary edition and my first time playing Beyond Good and Evil on the PS5. With that being said, I'll see you guys next show, next video. I'm out of here.